Hi friends, welcome to my channel Civil 3D Pro Designer. We have exercise number 6 for chapter number 14 How to edit a pipe network using properties Already we have done with editing tools and grips and now we are going to use properties uh, to edit our pipe network It's also very important exercise to get advanced knowledge about pipe networks editing many of uh, the values you need to change when editing pipes and structure can be found in their properties there are two ways to access the properties of a pipe or structure the civil 3d method and the autocad method also we will use all of them with the autocad method we will select the pipe or structure and then use the property command from the ribbon on the context menu as you know here uh, you are given access to a limit number of properties but the advantage of the civil 3d is that you can modify multiple pipes or structures simultaneously before starting if you are new on my youtube channel please subscribe civil 3d pro designer and if you are looking for more material related to civil 3d then you can uh, like my facebook page civil 3d pro designer where you can get uh, link for all of them in my description exercise number six in this exercise we will fix the issue with the sanitary pipe that is located far below the others and we will use properties to complete this task the problem with the incorrect pipe elevation was brought to your attention during the first exercise in this chapter when the sanitary receiver pipe network were first created as you remember in uh, the previous exercise number one for chapter number 14 download this drawing named editing pipe networks using properties and then open you will get these three viewports in this exercise we will focus on the sanitary receiver pipe that lies in medicine land in the profile view on the top right here notice that the pipe beginning at the intersection with logan court and ending at the medicine land cul-de-sac has been incorrectly placed at a very low elevation so we will adjust these using properties select uh, in the upper right viewport zoom into the medicine land profile here we have medicine land profile and note the label at the right and that reads uh, 55.160 this elevation corresponds with the center point of the cul-de-sac cul-de-sac actually our this portion of the road which is also the location of our manhole you can see here we have a manhole in the center of cul-de-sac now click in the left viewport and then zoom in and click the manhole located at the center of medicine land called disac this manhole click structure now sorry again select and select here structure now go to structure properties on the ribbon and if you are on information tab then go to parts properties and for automatic surface here if it is true then just select false for that for insertion rim elevation you need to find for rim elevation
insertion rim elevation it is 1.54 we need to change it from 55.216 and then click ok and a 3d viewport you can see the manhole become very tall here like the one just down the road from it this corrects the top elevation of the structure but the pipe still uh, requires some editing now press escape if you have selected anything then in the left viewport select the pipe that begins at the medicine lane cul-de-sac here we have pipe just select pipe and then select properties in the properties window change start invert elevation start invert elevation here and put 53.941 press enter close the property box with the pipe still selected click pipe properties on the ribbon on the part properties if you are here then you can switch to part properties box and enter minus 1.5 for pipe slope hold start minus 1.5 press enter and then ok these effects of these pipe edits are much more obvious in the 3d view port the pipe is corrected but the sump of the manhole at the cul de sac is still incorrected so press escape to clear the selection and now click the manhole at the center of medicine land cul de sac select structure and then go to structure properties although uh, it's already set to 0 0.6 for some depth type 2 here uh, sorry type 0 0.6 again and press enter and click ok the manhole depth is updated because the apparent changes to the pump uh, sump depth trigger a recalculation of the manhole dimension click the top right viewport here and zoom out until you can see the medicine land properties the profile view has been much shorter because uh, it's no longer needs to accommodate the excessively tall manhole so in this way you can make changes to your pipes your structure and you can change anything according to your design criteria hope you like this video if you are new please subscribe